Can you guess how many apps there are on the Google Play Store? Well, according to Statistica, there are over 2.6 million apps available. Now that is crazy. How many of those apps are used every day, do you think? Okay, I don't know that statistic myself, but what I do know is that I have five go-to apps that could make your experience with the Google Pixel 7 Pro even better. And to be honest with you, these aren't really limited to the Pixel 7 Pro. They're available on all Android phones, but you know, the Google Pixel 7 Pro just came out and I've got one and I'm still in my honeymoon period with it. And it's still semi-trending in the world, so you know we've got to capitalize on those hashtags and titling opportunities for this video. Anyway, here are the apps. Now I know that we've already talked about the Pixel 7 Pro having really awesome features on their camera already. The video will be up in a card here if you've missed that. But what if I told you that using Snapseed could also increase that performance? Now Snapseed is a very simple photo editing app that allows you to edit photos to a professional standard. Where something like Instagram's built-in editor allows you to add filters, Snapseed allows you to make minor adjustments to certain areas of a photo. And for example, if you've got an image of a cat you can only add some nice exposure changes to that cat's eyes without editing the entire image. It's great for those photographers who want a little bit more control over their editing processes without the need to crack open Lightroom or Photoshop on their PCs or MacBooks. To follow on from Snapseed, there's an awesome manual camera app called DSLR Camera Pro, which allows you to control all aspects of taking a photo, very much like it would on a proper DSLR camera. You can change your aperture, your exposure levels with bracketing, it has a manual focus and different white balance levels, it has everything any budding photographer needs to capture an amazing image. Sure it does cost £3.99 in the UK but to be honest I think that's an absolute steal. Now let me paint a picture. To transfer my images to my PC I used to plug in my phone via USB, find the DCIM folder and drag and drop the images to my desktop. Now though with your phone companion you can wirelessly connect directly to your phone to save images to your PC directly from the app. It's free to use and very simple to set up and you can also reply to text messages, you know those SMS messages from the past, directly from your PC though who really sends SMS messages anymore. Having an app that can stream music to your phone in 2022 is a no-brainer and look I wanted to include just one of these next apps being Spotify but I'm realistic, I live in the real world and there are definitely people out there using other music streaming services as their go-to apps. I personally use Spotify on a daily basis, whether I'm at home, in the office, or walking around my local supermarket during my weekly food shop. I've got Spotify playing. And now that apps like Spotify have a huge music library, they also provide podcasts as well. It can turn a mundane task like food shopping into a personal concert, a comedy show, or a learning experience if you're into those kind of podcasts. If you're anything like me, then note-taking runs certain aspects of your life, and Material Notes does a great great job with its fantastic organizational features. You have the chance to color code your notes, whether it's your shopping list in green, your work schedule in yellow, or who you need to buy birthday cards for in blue. You can even star certain notes if they're of urgent priority. If you're also saving some sensitive data on the app in one of the notes, you can lock notes with four digit security pin numbers, which is super useful. And it even comes with a set of widgets so you can attach your notes to the home screen so you can have eyes on whenever you unlock your phone. It's free to download and will definitely increase your productivity as it makes it very easy to organize your projects. So there you have it, five apps that work absolutely superbly on the Google Pixel 7 Pro for you to get the most out of this phone. Get them downloaded today, they're still available on the Google Play Store. And thank you very much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please hit that like button, subscribe to keep up with our latest tech and gaming videos, and also let us know in the comments down below if you have any go-to apps or what are some of your favorite apps on Google Play Store at the moment. As I say, thanks very much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.